next speaker is Yin Zhang from Hebei Medical University, China. Yin Zhang got her master's degree from Hebei Medical University in 2005, and she is a PhD student and working as an associate professor at the same time. Her current research interests focus on effects of traditional Chinese medicine with efficacy of promoting blood circulation against even overlay disorders. She so recently found that treatment with saliva uh, multi-multi-oriza tension reduced iron deposition and uh, ameliorate pathological changes in mice with acute and uh, chronic iron overload. Thank you. Dear ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. Uh, it's really my great honor to have this opportunity uh, to, per, uh, to present our study. Uh, my name is Zhang Ying, uh, but in English, my name is Ying Zhang. I come from Hebei Medical University, China. My topic is mechanism. My topic is mechanism of protective effects of solvent mutual resin tension against acute and chronic liver injury induced by iron overload. Uh, my presentation includes four sections. First, introduction. Iron is essential for normal biological is, uh, functioning, but it's toxic when presents in excess, in excess. Under normal condition, under normal condition, systemic iron homostasis is tightly regulated. As a central, as a central in the in regulating homo, iron homostasis, liver is the most susceptible organ of injury by iron overload. Iron overload is a common clinical problem, including hereditary hemochromatosis and secondary iron overload, such as transferrin-dependent anemia, thalassemia, and chronic liver disease. Uh, patient, patients with iron overloaded condition can develop uh, can develop acute liver injury called chron uh, chronic hepatic fibrosis, cirrhosis, and even hepatocellular carcinoma. And the current mainstay of therapy for iron overload, uh, for iron overload in patients is iron chelation. Iron chelation are designed to promote whole body air removal. For example, defrocsamine, DFO. Uh, also, Collectors reduce mor uh, morbidity and mortality, but the cumbersome administration schedule and the serious side effects leads to poor patient compliance. Uh, moreover, collectors cannot exhibit iron take uptake into cells in those in which iron enters cells through specific pathways. And toxicity is mediator by oxidative stress. Excessive spray, excessive spray on induced reactive oxygen spaces. Uh, this ROS can damage membrane limits, mem mem uh, limit membrane and uh, DNA and proteins. Uh, finally, uh, iron toxicity uh, can drive acute damage and chronic fibros uh, and chronic fibrogenesis. A uh, recent study on heart showed that calcium channel provide a major pathway for iron uptake into cells, and the calcium channel blockers can inhibit iron entry into 
into sales. So based the above information, <coughs> uh, <coughs> we found a number of medicinal herb medicine with efficacy of promoting blood circulation has anti-oxidation effects. And uh, some active compounds in this herbal medicine can inhibit calcium entry into cells. And this herbal medicine exhibit per a, a property of calcium channel blockers. Uh, in a preliminary experiment, <coughs> some medi uh, medicinal herb with efficacy of promoting, uh, including Chuan Chong Qing, Ge Gen Su, Deng Jian Hua Su, and Dan Shen, so well mutual reza, were choose and failed and failed to treat iron overloaded liver in mass. As a result, we found so well mutual reza demonstrate significant protective effects in air overloaded liver in mass. So the other, the other herb were abandoned. Danshen is a toxic herb of no toxic superior class with efficacy promoting blood circulation. Danshen highly used for its dried roots. Uh, it has been used for uh, you used to, uh, it has been used for ch traditional Chinese therapy for more than 2,000 years. Uh, as a well-known traditional medicine with hepatoprotective effects, Danshen has versatile antifibrotic, antioxidative, uh, anti-inflammatory, and anti-apoptotic uh, effects. Tension injection, a quivers extract, is uh, highly recommended and uh, widely accepted treats for liver diseases. Uh, so our present study was designed to investigate the effects of tension injection in promoting liver damage, acute <coughs> injury and hepatic fibrosis, chronic injury, caused by eye overload, and explore the mechanism involved. The second section, material and method, experimental protocol. 16, uh, 16 male mouse were divided into five groups, control, eye overloaded, low dose tension, high dose, and DFO, defrocosanine, as a positive, as a positive uh, drug. First, the mice were, uh, were given imperial newly injection daily, silent, low dose, and high dose, and defrocosanine. At the same time, four hours later, the control were given silent, and the later four groups were given iron. And repeat, repeat again. Acute injury, acute injury experiment, experiment, uh, uh, experiment lasts for two weeks, and the chronic, chronic injury lasts for seven weeks. Method. HPLC profiling, morphology observation, immunohistochemistry, RT-PCR, and the liver faction detection and oxidative markers detection. The third section, results and discussion. The figure, figure one show, uh, figure one, is HPLC, three major, three major components of tension injection were detected and qualified. 
Danshan injection mainly include Danshan Su. Procotec Hig. Procotec uh, Hig. L head. And uh, Sunwell Nautic Acid B. This figure show the effects of tension on growth appearance and coefficients in mass liver. Look at this figure A, control, figure B, figure B, I overloaded liver. The liver color is brown, brown and swollen and become hard. Stiffness. After treat with tension, low dose and high dose, the appearance, the appearance, partly restored, restored, recovered, and the liver coefficient, liver, figure F show liver coefficient, liver coefficient. Look at this, iron overload, increased significantly compared with control. Uh, treat with low and uh, low dose and high high dose tension, liver coefficient decreased markedly. De decreased markedly. This figure show effects then uh, effects of tension on level of AST, AST and uh, ALT and uh, AST in serum. ALT and uh, AST is well recognized to access the liver function, the liver function. In iron, in iron overloaded group, AST and ALT, notably elevated, elevated. Tension treatment, both low dose and high dose, high dose reduce their levels. Uh, this figure show iron deposition. Iron deposition. <coughs> this figure was stained by push blue staining. Push blue staining. Look at this figure B. Iron over iron overloaded liver. The blue points. The blue points is iron deposition. Push blue. Uh, push blue staining is specific for iron deposition. So look at this. After treat with tension, the air, the air percentage area of air deposition significantly reduced. Uh, moreover, the effects was in dose dependent manner. It's a statistic. Positive, positive, uh, positive, positive airs of blue, uh, blue, blue sta staining. Uh, figure six show effects of tension on, on S, SOD, GSH, and MDA. Uh, since I can trigger oxidative stress and lipid per oxidative, GSH and S, uh, SOD are the markers of oxidative stress. And MDA is a main production of lipid peroxidation. So look at figure A and B. In iron overloaded group, iron overloaded group, GSH and GSOD and GSH decreased compared with control. But treat with Tension, treat with tension, uh, treat with tension, SOD and GSH and elevated. Contrast to this two, this two. Air overloaded cube, MDA elevated, ele elevated significantly. After treat with tension, MDA decreased. Uh, this figure. Uh, this figure show effects of tension on apoptosis of mass apoptosis. Uh, look at this figure B. 
in an overloaded liver, in an overloaded liver, the brown positive staining, the staining is hepatoapoptosis. Apoptosis. After treat with tension, tension, the apoptosis of uh, liver cells decreased. Decreased. Uh, with PCR, with PCR, we also detected the caspase three mRNA. Uh, the results are similar to the apoptosis. Uh, uh, based on Figure two to seven, in crowd, uh, in acute liver injury experiment, we found that tension injection could. Uh, could decrease liver coefficient, restore abnormal liver function, and improve pathological changes. The underlying mechanism may be attributed partly to decrease of iron deposition, inhibition of oxidative stress, and uh, apatol, and uh, inhibit uh, inhibition of apatol in hepatocytes. Uh, this is results and discussion in our acute liver injury in, uh, induced by iron overloaded experiment. The next, uh, the second experiment, uh, we will uh, we study the chronic injury induced by iron, induced by iron overload. Figure eight. Figure 8 shows effects of tension treat on hepatic fibrosis. We well observed by muscle staining. Muscle staining is specific for collagen fiber. For collagen fiber. Look at figure B. In iron overloaded liver, the bright blue color, the bright blue color represents the collagen fibers. After treat with after treat with tension low dose and high dose, the percentage area uh, uh, of collagen significant reduced reduced. This is the statistic uh, statistic figure. Mm. This picture shows the effects of tension on type three collagen in liver. Uh, look at figure B, iron overloaded section, iron, uh, iron overloaded liver. Type three collagen is the main, com uh, is, is the main components of collagen uh, of collagen during hepatic fibrosis. Type three collagen increased and uh, expand and uh, intensive massive. In this section, treat with tension. Treat, treat with tension. Type three collagen area reduced significantly. Uh, we also detected HYP compa uh, contents. HYP is an amino acid. It's well. It's a widely accepted marker for qualifying the level. Of fibrosis. In our overloaded groups, HYP increased. Tension treatment decreased. Tension treatment decreased their levels. Uh, figure 10 shows effects of tension on mRNA expression of TGF beta and MMP9. TGF beta strongly attributed to the fibro fibrotic genesis. In contrast to TGF beta, MMP9 is capable of degrade, uh, degrading collagens. So look at the uh, look at the picture of figure A. Our overloaded group TGF beta elevated tension treatment. Tension after tension treatment, TGF beta decreased. 
and in a dose-dependent manner. In contrast to TGF-beta, MMP9, MMP9. In our overloaded group, is low. But treated with tension, MMP9 is high. And the effect tension and the effects of tension was in a dose dependent manner. Okay, in a chronic hepatic injury experiment, we found tension injection can decrease hepatic fibrosis in an overloaded liver. The underlying mechanism may be involved in the decrease of collagen accumulation, regulation expression of fibrosis molecules, uh, such as TGF-beta and MMP9. The fourth section, conclusion. Uh, we suppose that tension play a protective role on air overloaded liver. Tension may be a therapeutic drug for air overloaded disease. That's all. Thank you for your attention. Okay, thank you for my presentation. Well, I will ask that have you used the power compound or the crude extract and about the injection whether well, it is from the crude extract or whatever maybe what is that and then you have in the LC uh, profile you have some minor compound which might be UV inactive I don't know uh, have you think about that the first thing is that that have you used the crude extract or power compound uh, over the what is what is what do you mean by higher dose? Uh, have you uh, mm, mm, uh, I mean that what is the standard? What is the weight of the standard? What is the concentration of the standard? Or what's the standard concentration of pure compound? So I don't understand the high concentration, and low concentration, and have you used the crude extract? Thank you. Uh, the compound uh, the we use tension, uh, tension injection we used in our experiment. The next, uh, the next study we used compound. We used compound. Uh, so we are now, uh, we are now doing the study in our uh, lab. Uh, for you know, you um, always mention the low cons low dose of SM. High dose of SM. You never mention about the. Uh, you never say about the compound. What compound? How much? But just show SM. SM is derivatives of the that uh, plants. So it's not clear. Yeah. Yeah, SM. Your plant SM. So what? Whether you tried your compounds, wh whether you uh, think about the minor peaks, that which component is active. And you always use this uh, crude extract rather, but not about the uh, nothing about the uh, uh, the compound, the compound which you are selected. Just use the word low, low dose and high dose of acid. So, you understand what I mean? So I don't. Okay. So I think there's a communication problem. <laughs> <laughs> SM is the abbreviation of so the abbreviation. PCM and uh, a similar study uh, uh, with compounds and uh, nowadays it is an S check. Okay. Short for Sandia Neutralizer, that's the, mm. the Latin name of the extract. The so that's the question yeah. that whether she used the extract or power compound and what means extract, extract. Yeah. yeah so extract then what's the injection made of the injection which you have shown that people use it for the hepatic protective so what's the injection made of is it as a crude extract yeah oh. Okay, the, the injection has been uh, used in hospital. Okay. The last question. Tell me, tell me.
transfusion-dependent anemia, thalassemia, and chronic and chronic liver disease. Uh, so the second, uh, the second uh, iron overloaded condition is common in hospital. <laughs> okay, next uh, speaker. Thank you again. Thank you.